So here we have the Condor A4 V2 in 170 second scale. This is a different kit than the Revell kit, which is much nicer detailed. But this one is pretty okay as well. First we're gonna have a look inside and then I'm going to build it. Okay, there's just this one sprue. And it's a very basic kit. There are a couple of challenging uh, parts here. Because there are like no alignment pins or whatever. So you have to align everything very carefully. But, well, I think we can manage that. And the parts are slightly flashy here and there. As you may be able to see here is a bit on the a bit of flash on the tip and the fins here. But the basic detail is very nice. It's recessed panel lining and it's just basically a V2. And here with the instruction sheet. It's just a couple of seconds. Most of the work actually goes into the launching platform. The V2 is just like these two halves, a couple of fins and these um, yeah, graphite. Uh, in reality they were made from graphite. Um, uh, the jet steering vanes <laughs> and the exhaust pipe and that's the missile. And the rest, the most complex part, is basically the la uh, the launching platform. So you have to like carefully follow these instructions. Now there are two paint schemes. Here's the so-called yeah uh, wavy or flaming pattern which was actually not it, it was used but for a, for a very short while as a sort of test camo and it says here um, that the, uh, it was uh, stationed or, or fired from Duindicht Holland which is actually spelled wrong here um, it's Duindicht with a G here um, and actually from that spot, the or near that spot, it's uh, near The Hague, the first V2s were launched from that place uh, towards London. Um, but this uh, scheme was uh, very early and actually very rare. Most of the V2s were painted in this uh, splinter pattern <laughs> and the pattern was roughly followed uh, they weren't like all exactly paint to, uh, painted to this uh, exact scheme there were some minor differences between the schemes and in the later uh, stages of the war actually uh, uh, this uh, 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 rockets uh, apparently launched from Germany um, in uh, March 1945 and by that time most V2s were just painted plain green because well uh, they were just uh, desperately shooting as many as they could in the final stage stage of the war and they didn't really bother with camouflaging them anymore so this uh, will be another challenging part like masking everything for getting this, uh, this uh, pattern together. You of course have your uh, obligatory stories here in Czech and uh, English and German. Your call is your sprue map. Okay, so let's go.